Welcome to my YouTube channel, Missionaries for Jesus. Please do like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Aliza Agnew, birth, the 2nd of February 1807, death, the 14th of June 1883, city, New York, country, America. Place of vision, Sri Lanka. Aliza Agnew was born to pious Christian parents James and Jane Agnew in New York. From her school days, she cherished the resolve to do the mission work. In 1823, she heard John Scudder speaking in a revival meeting and accepted Christ as her personal savior. She joined the Orange Street Presbyterian Church and began to conduct Bible studies and distribute tracts. In 1839, she joined the American Board of Commissioners for Foreign Missions ABCFM, and was appointed for the Ceylon Sri Lanka Mission. Aliza arrived in Jaffna, Sri Lanka in 1840 and was appointed as a teacher in female boarding school in Udumal. Later, under her principalship, the school made remarkable progress. Her extraordinary leadership not only made the school a place of formal education but also a source of spiritual enlightenment. Many girls were saved and grew in the knowledge of Christ. She personally strengthened the faith of many girls who went back to their places as messengers of Christ. During the summer vacations, she used to visit her ex-students and counsel them in matters of spiritual affairs and home economics. Her concern for the spiritual welfare of those placed under her care earned her the title, Mother of a Thousand Daughters. Aliza led a prayerful life which had an incalculable effect on her associates. Her students testified that no rising bell was needed to wake them in the morning, for they heard Aliza praying loudly for every girl in an adjoining room. She also trained more than 40 women who went out into the Sri Lanka villages to preach the gospel. Aliza retired in 1879 and chose to stay back in Sri Lanka. She moved to Manape, where she kept herself busy leading the backslidden sheep into Christ's flock. After a brief illness, Aliza left for her heavenly abode in 1883. Beloved, have you realized the potency of prayer in your daily chores? Lord, help me to prayerfully impact the lives of my co-workers. Amen. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel.